Hey guys, it's Sam here from HowToFQ and today I'm going to show you a really quick and easy method to remove ads from your internet browser. So, it's the type of ads that you get when you're searching or you go to google.com and it just redirects you to an ad link. It's kind of weird, it's like make free money or any sort of weird, you know it's ads, you know it's fake and it's just redirected you to it. It's not taking you to the real website. So you've got in these virus extensions and all these weird things that shouldn't be there but programmers have just installed them without your permission so I'm gonna show you a quick easy way to remove them so what you wanna do is you wanna to go to Google and you wanna just type in ADW cleaner and just search that and it should be the first link here just click on that click download I'll put the link in the description for those who don't have it and don't know how to get access to it but I'll put this link in the description now once it opens up it should look like this and what you want to do is you want to click scan and it'll search through for all the possible errors and different ways I've scanned this a few times before so I, I don't think I'll have uh, many errors if any but it's always good to just scan this regularly just so it can remove all those ads because the type of ads you can get um, the ad where you can get it can actually be in placed into your registry keys so you could delete everything and it could still be in the registry keys so that's that's one thing you have to take into account and okay here you go so here are some examples of the threats you can get this one's called pair to logic and this is other one which I've never heard of before which is all pair to logic so as you can see uh, I've got these three threats here and the way to get rid of them is just click clean and this will get rid of all these viruses so I'm just gonna click OK so as you can see this is actually performed a restart now and this actually force closes all your programs and then it forces a restart so it forces everything to refresh so any for example any running malware can just be stopped instantly so that's the best way of doing it and it actually opens up on the restart um, a, a little text file of all the places where all the documents were deleted from this deletes some stuff in the registry keys and has the text files of all the different runs of ccleaner here so yeah pretty cool so I thought I'd just share this with you. This is the best way of removing ads. It's 100% free and it's really no hassle. Very quick, very easy. So thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, click the annotations on the screen now to watch another video. Be sure you subscribe to the channel. I make videos every week and be sure to drop a like too. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.